Hi, this is Ray Pollack uh, bringing you in-depth analysis of the opening mm -hmm. session of uh, Sunday night's Keeneland September yearling sale, which continues tonight uh, with a second evening session. Uh, this analysis is sponsored by, oh, we don't, we don't have a sponsor. Brad, I thought, why am I even doing this? So, Brad, if we don't, if, I thought you were going to get a sponsor for this, Brad. I don't need the teleprompter. I, you know, let's just, we'll just do this live, okay? We'll just do this live. So a lot of horses sold, uh, but a lot of them didn't sell. You know, there, there was one common theme throughout the sale last night, and that's that every horse that went into the ring was, uh, was one year old, a yearling. Uh, most of them had four legs. There were a few in there with three, and they, most of those didn't sell, to be honest with you. But uh, it was, uh, you know, my, my, if I could put it in, in a single word uh, how it went last night, I would say uh, per, pretty good, pretty good. But it's early. Uh, the sale continues tonight. They'll be selling more horses, uh, and then it goes into book two on Tuesday, followed by another session on Wednesday and another session on Thursday. Uh, they take Friday off for Good News Friday, which is sponsored by Three Chimneys Farm. Thank you, Three Chimneys. Thank you very much. Uh, but uh, and then we continue from Saturday on uh, through September 24th. So, you know, if you've always wanted a thoroughbred racehorse, come on out to Keeneland. They got them. They're all a year old, and most of them have four legs. <laughs>